Welcome to the AJ Awesome Show. My name is AJ, and my special guest for this episode is the native beast, Nyla Rose. I hope you like it. Hello, my name is AJ Awesome, and I'm here with the native beast, Nyla Rose. Do I call you Mr. Awesome, or how does that work? Mr. AJ, Mr. Awesome? Just call me AJ. Okay, okay, AJ. Why did you start wrestling? I started wrestling because I also was a fan of wrestling. And um, after watching it for so long, I just really wanted to do it. What advice would you give a new wrestler? Ooh, uh, what advice would I give a new wrestler? Treat yourself like a business. Um, you, you, you are an athlete, but at the same time, you are also a business. So if you have a business mindset, then it'll help you progress your career. If you could pick anybody in the world, who would be your tag team partner? Oh, that's a really good question. Anyone in the world? Um, I would probably pick, uh, Takumi Aroha from Japan. Uh, she's with Marvelous, and I've trained with her and worked with her a few times, and I think her and I would make a really good tag team. But that's not to take away from my tag team partner over there, Mio Momono. So that's, that's kind of a tough, tough call. I'd, I'd love to bring Mio over here, because as Mabudachi, we uh, tend to tear it up pretty good. What was your favorite cartoon when you were a kid? <laughs> Uh, I had a bunch of them. Um, one of my favorite cartoons as a kid was Transformers, uh, as well as Thundercats. What is the proudest moment of your career? Um, if I can be honest, the proudest moment of my career was getting the validation of having AEW approach me and wanting to work with me. Uh, for me, that told me that everything I was doing, I shouldn't doubt myself anymore, and I should, uh, I'm, I'm moving in the right direction. Can you tell me the story of how you got signed to AEW? Oh, absolutely. Um, it's kind of a boring story. Uh, so the story of how I got started with AEW is uh, I was on Twitter one night, and I got a uh, message from Kenny Omega, who kind of briefed me on what was about to happen and asked me if that was something I may be interested in. Um, once I realized it was actually Kenny Omega and not somebody messing with me, uh, we exchanged phone numbers and we actually had a professional conversation. And the rest, as they say, is history. If you could choose to have three wishes granted, what would you wish for? Can I wish for more wishes? No. Ah. Can I wish for more genies? No. Oh, you're, you drive a hard bargain. Um, if I could have any three wishes, I would say uh, first and foremost, well, I'm not going to need to wish it, but let's, let's speed up the timeline a little bit. I'd wish that I was AEW Women's Champion. Um, I would wish that we could bring Marvelous over here to the U.S. and uh, integrate them with AEW. And then I would wish that Mio, Takumi, and I somehow used Freeburg rules and were the women's AEW tag champions. I'm sure the first one you wouldn't need to wish for. I agree. Who was your favorite wrestler when you were a kid? The one and only Undertaker. That's the exact same as my sister. <laughs> really? Yeah. She's got good taste. <laughs> Do you have a special talent that nobody knows about? Oh, um, I'm pretty good at, at doing this thing, the thumb, the thumb trick. That's, that's probably, that's all I got. <laughs> um, uh, no, all jokes aside, uh, I'm pretty, pretty good cook. Uh, I don't really follow any recipes. I just kind of look at flavors and mix and match and I haven't killed anybody yet. What is the best starter Pokemon and why? Uh, the best, I don't, I, you know, I don't know if it's the best starter Pokemon, but I'm a little biased. I'm going to go with Charmander. Uh, I love a fire type. Maybe it's because I'm a Leo and that's a fire sign, but I'm going to go with Charmander. You evolve them, get up your Charizard. No competition. There's no, there's no competition. I would choose any type of water type starter because I'm a Pisces and 
Pisces are water. That's no that's pretty much why I chose Charmander. <laughs> See, good minds, great minds think alike. Yeah. <laughs> what is your favorite ice cream flavor? Uh, I cheat. I got two. I got mint chocolate chip and cookies and cream. I have cookie dough and Rocky Road. Oh, cookie dough's a good one. Cookie dough's a good one. Who do you predict to be the first AEW Women's Champion? AJ, come on. Come on. Predict myself. Yeah. Now, if I'm, if, if I'm a little biased, I kind of also might predict that Brandy's going to do some kind of screwball something and maybe steal it. But if we're talking fair, then it's going to be me. Um, if you didn't win... The Battle Royal, who would you choose to win it? Ooh. Uh, if I didn't win, mm, that's a really tough question. If I didn't win, I think I might go with, uh, might go with Allie. I think she'd be a good, good candidate. That's the end. Thanks for the interview. Thank you, Mr. Awesome. I hope you enjoyed this episode of the AG Awesome Show. I would like to thank Nala Rose for being my special guest. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you next time!